What's up, YouTube? It's Ghost Fest Marine. Today we're coming back with a Q&A video. Last week, it was about Monday, I posted on my Snapchat, asking a lot of questions for a Q&A vid. So I figured I'd do a Q&A vid for y'all today because a lot of people ask me questions. And I was going to try to make a video on it so it's easier for all y'all to know about me more. Because if you follow me on Snapchat, if you follow my Instagram, or if you go to school, you know a little bit about me. But if you really just follow me on YouTube, you don't know that much about me. So, I'm in yoga right now. Here, I'll, I'll, I'll start with the like, strain record. So, yeah, let's see the questions. Two, one. Alright, so it started. Alright, so these are about all the questions I have for today. Here, I'll start with. Where are you from? Well, I'm from St. Louis, Missouri. STL, shout out STL. Uh, someone from YouTube definitely me, actually. Uh, someone said, how tall are you? A lot of people asking that too. I'm 5'9", about 5'10". Uh, and I'm a 7th grade. A lot of people don't believe that, but I'm a 7th grade. Uh, someone says, how is BB? Now, if you know who she is, you know, but it's good. What's your favorite shoe that you want? My favorite shoe that I want that I don't have is probably the Off-White Air Force MCAs, I think it's called. It's like, I'll put the pitch up on the screen. I, I think that's what they're called. Pretty sure. Who's your favorite YouTuber to watch? If I said my favorite YouTuber to watch, it'd probably be like, Pretty Boy Fredo, Flight. Um, what's what I like? I like, I like BTS The Name, The Boy J, Dom, Dom Dom. Who else do I watch? I like DDG, all the, the hoes you did. I mess with them. I just like Cash Nasty, Chris Moves. Most, I, met, I wouldn't mess with most of them. People like around that area. <clears throat> how, many likes, how many likes do we have to get so you can do a wave check? Uh, get us good to 25 likes and I'll do a wave check next year. <laughs> what grade are you in? I'm in seventh grade. How long have you known Basic Gaming? How did you guys meet and start the plan? So I met Basic Gaming on PS3. Here, so let me back it up. It was like 2017, 2018. And remember, PS4 came out in 2014. I got money for Christmas, so I got like 300 plus. So I bought me a PS3, and the PS4 was out, and I had enough money to get a PS4. But I was being cheap, because so I thought the PS3 and 4, they was just the same exact thing. They said, well, your difference <coughs> with system. Not one year. Well, like when you're dating with the system or whatever. So I bought a PS3 and I started playing like 2K18 on it because it was 2017 at the time. Yeah, so the game comes out like, like that year. So like 2K21 come out this year, almost the end of this year or whatever. So I'll start playing the game and his name was like Mechanic004. And like I ran with him, like it was like a normal game and just my favorite blacktop. And basically, I, I thought he was pretty good, so I like, texted him after the game, like, saying you want to run or something. And he was like, yeah, what's up? So I had to go cook real quick. I had to go cook, so I had to leave him. <clears throat> and when I came back, we started, like, talking. And we, we played for, like, almost, like, a month, month and a half. And then, like, I asked for his phone number if you wanted to talk. Because, like, on PS2, like, nobody had a mic. Like, it was really just, like, you talk on the phone while you're playing or you just, you just play like that or you just text during the game or whatever. So... I used to like text during the game and stuff, tell each other different stuff, they like switch me and stuff like that, and pause for y'all such people. But it was about then, and he had asked for his phone number, and he said he didn't have his phone yet because it broke, but he, I can give him his house phone number. I mean, he can give me his house phone number. So I gave him his house phone number, we like finally talked for the first day, we talked for like, it was like, I think it was like two hours on the phone, about, and then we just got closer and closer. We play more PS3. And then I finally got a headset and he got a headset so we could talk on the game. And from there we pretty much got, like got a PS4. Uh played all over the summer together. Played Fortnite. Played 2K19. I got 20, but he couldn't get 19 yet. He stayed on 19 and now he has 20 so we're playing 20 together now. So we've known each other for like three years now, bro. Uh, why do you think LeBron is better than Jordan and why? Well, do you think LeBron is better than Jordan and why? Personally, I think LeBron is better than Jordan, but it depends who you ask. It's like you could say, Jordan, he's a player that's going to put up points for the team. He's not like a contributor. He's not a floor general like LeBron. 
LeBron distributes the ball and makes other people on the court better. Jordan, he's he's a guy that's gonna give you points. He's not gonna make everybody on the floor better. He had guys with him to help him win, but LeBron basically had no help and he still won a ring. We know Jordan has six and what LeBron has two, three. I still think LeBron's better than my opinion. Despite who scores more points, like who has more triple doubles, you know. To me, I think LeBron's really good. How did you make paper off? All right. A lot of people ask me this too on my song that I dropped. I'll put the link in the description for it. So paper out, it really came about. So my science teacher, shout out to him, Mr. O.D. But anyway, uh, he was like, so class, we're gonna like start making like poems and songs. And we're gonna like, it's gonna have to be like kind of related to science, like a little bit like your song. So I started like, I started like trying to come up with lyrics and stuff. And he gave us about like two weeks to do this two, three weeks, like, to tweak it and, like, start the song and stuff. So, I, like, I started my song, like, I'm back in the studio. I was trying to, like, I was trying to, like, think of something, like, catchy that people, like, like, bob their heads to and, like, a decent beat on the song. So, like, people could, like, vibe to it or whatever. So, I was, like, I was, like, I'll see up, like, three in the morning one time, like, literally just, like, making up the lyrics and stuff. And keep in mind, like, this was, like, something school-related. Like, say, like, I have eight hour science and that's at the end of the day so like that's the very my very last class of the day so that was like eight hour science was like 124 to 255 and school ends at 255 so like that's the time that we were supposed to work on our song but I decided to work in mine at home because I just wanted to make it better because a lot of kids were just working on it in the classroom but it really wasn't enough time for me to be honest so <coughs> excuse me <coughs> hey hey chill that's not going but yeah, I started working on it at home a little bit. And there was like the day that we were like supposed to kind of like turn them in or whatnot. And like, keep in mind, like a lot of people asking like, Adam, can I work with you? Adam, can I work with you? I'm like, nah, I want to be a solo. I didn't want like, I really didn't want anyone working like that. So I decided not to. So he like, he was like, listen to my song. Like, he's like, how you doing? And I'm like, I'm good, I'm good. And he was like, you want to listen to it? Like, see how it is? I was like, yeah, that's fine, that's fine. So I, I don't know, he started losing to him, like I'm back on this paper route. He was like, I said, focus on me, we're ever gonna fill in my bank account. And he's like, oh, okay. But like, even my, my song, like, I literally just like made that song, just like, no, no science turns nothing. I just made it like, fully just how I wanted it to be. And then at the end, he was like, but you know, you has to be like, kind of science related to I'm like, oh, I forgot. So that's like, cool, like, make little tweaks, like, put like, like I said, Hit the gas, take a flight. I was gonna say ele elevate to a real summation, and he's like put like evaporate to a real summation. I was like, all right. So like I just had like just little stuff like that in. So like my song, my song's like it's how I want it, but it's also science terms in there. So like it's, it's like the rubric on spreading system. So then it was like present day. So I was like that like I was like scared. Everybody in the class was scared. It was shaking. He like plays your song like on the board, like and it's on like the little speaker above like he has in the classroom or whatever. And my song was like it was like fourth or third to last and there's like twenty like twenty some kids in the class too. And like keep mind it was like partners too, so it wasn't just like twenty like individual people, it was like people there were some groups of four, three, two, and then there was the, the solo people, but he had most of the groups go first to get their side of the way because their songs were used to be longer. And then the solos go last. And I was on the solo, so I went last. So, yeah, he like played my song, and it sounded like weird over the things. Like the volume that he had today, it was like, it was like kind of like irish. Like some of the songs sounded okay, and some just sounded like terrible. I mean, my song, I thought it was pretty good, but like how it sounded on the thing, it was like really weird. So like he played or whatever, and they're like, oh, okay, I'm not like this song. Like how, how much time do you spend on? And I was like, I've been working on it for like the two weeks, like you said, like from the deadline and I was working on it at home. He's like, oh, okay, that's cool. And the other kids in the class. And then like, at the end of the class, you vote who you want to win, but you, you can't you can't vote for yourself. Just vote for someone else. And it ended up being a three-way tie between uh, this one group, group of four, no, no, group of three. It was a group of three. It was one other girl and it was me. So he had to do another round. So everyone votes again, like in the whole class, which you can't vote for yourself. And the people that won couldn't vote for anyone either, obviously. So then my 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 song went again. So the one solo girl got out of the round, and then it was just me and then the group of three left. So he's like, here's the final one, because like me and them tied again. 
like if they if one of us would have got more than the other then they would have won but they got it was a tie between me and them. I don't remember the exact score, but I just knew it was a tie. So then he's like, so the final winner is, and then he like, he didn't put it up on the board. He said, so, 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 and they won. They like got first for the class. I was like, bro. But to be honest, in my opinion, I thought my song was personally better, in my opinion, but there was a lot of, you can say there's a lot of girls in the class. All the girls were for girls, the boys were for, that's more like that. That's basically how it was in that class, because it was more, it was more biased than it was who songs better in my opinion that's how i felt it was so and whoever wins for your class they go like they perform in front of the whole school not the school they perform in front of the whole grade like on stage hey stefan after this video but basically whoever songs won for the class that's the song that uh they're gonna perform and there's there's so there's north side like not not like there's a north side of the school and like a south side and basically north has their all, all their science classes and south has all their science classes so basically so basically like they, they set that up to like where so like say if you're first hour and you're mr od and then the other teacher i'm not gonna say her name but we call him mr od for sure that's not your name for y'all that don't know so it's like first hour OD, then it's like uh, first hour her, second hour OD, second hour her, third hour OD, uh, third hour her, like that. And I was eighth hour, so my song was like very last. And keep in mind, it's like the whole grade, it's like a hundred plus people in the gym, plus the teachers, plus the principal, plus the guidance counselor, all, all of them in there, and parents came too, parents were invited to come. It was at the end of the day, like on a Friday. So a lot of people song play. There was a lot. There was like a lot of good songs. And there was some ones who were like iffy, but they were decent. So my song went last. And like you can have you, you can have people up on the stage with you if you want to, but you didn't have to. So basically, I invite some of my friends on stage with me because I just didn't want to be up there alone, even though I was solo. Like just like dancing or doing whatever they wanted. So I had them go up there and I like did my song. Remember, everybody, 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 everybody was like Evan, Evan, like so and so, so and so wanted me to win. I was like, yeah, what's up? Like, from the uh, stage up there, pointing out to him. And then, like, I finished my song. And then my song was the very last one of the day. So then they got into voted. And they were like, so basically they were like, whose song wins? It's not a song like, it's on like on your science terms. Like, it kind of like follows the rubric. It wasn't just whose song was the best. It was like, whose song follows the rubric and was still good. So basically, at that, on my so basically if that it, it's basically yeah whoever has the whoever song follows the, the rubric on like the four three two and one basically like that and they said so they started from third place and they went up to first the third place the one this uh the boy won his name so i'm not gonna say his name but he won so like they like congratulate him whatever and they like put his name like on the screen in big letters and the second place was like another girl that won and she was like her song was good she had, had everybody like clapping like this or like her song was her song was good and then for first place they're like drum roll please or whatever and i'm just like sitting there like crossing my fingers hoping i win he said evan i was like yes so i went for like my whole like school for my song or whatever we got like we went up on stage we got like congratulating we got like t-shirts and everything and then from that we went on to regionals and regionals is like so basically like people from, who are from your school represent your school. So like, we're in set, I'm in seventh grade, right? And the three people won. So basically, us three people from, I don't know if you see my school name, but us three people from my school will go to regionals and compete against other schools. So I ended up, I didn't win in regionals, but the two people that got second and third, they won second and third in the regionals and they got money. First place was 300, and second was 200, and third place was 100. But it, it was a pretty good day. I, I enjoyed it. And they had like food and like drinks and stuff there. But it, it was a pretty, it was really solid overall. I had to be D. I don't even know that. I'm not kidding about that. I'll tell you how to storm a high man DD. If I get 30 likes in this video, and I'll tell you how the story.